Hello family, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Consider this video as one of interesting videos because we are going to discuss about the potentials that we see on gold. Now, gold has a most priceless opportunity this coming week. Now, we are going to watch it, but before that, let's have a quick review on what we did the analysis of last video where we discussed the Euro USD as well as DXY. Remember, last video, if I've not watched the video, they didn't really pop up like they in your left corner. Make sure you watch it out because it's more educational wise. Now, this is what you see right now on the screen is DXY. As the in simple introduction on DXY, this why represent the dollar strength. Now, once you know the dollar strength, it's easy for you to know what other pairs which are pairing USD, what they'll do on the chart. Now, the chart here on one day was it has a little bit, um, a little bit pullback on the bearish, but we are in a bullish market structure. Now, let's view it real quick. Let's have a quick review of what we traded this week. The first trade was on Euro USD, the second trade was on gold, GBP USD, USD card, and much more. But this is not what I want you to see. Not like I'm on a performance, yeah, elite members. Now, these are my members. Most of the time, Kaba Ufanya, any different trades. We do analysis, for kill up Monday. We do what you call the live trading or the sorry, the live analysis. So, this is a Euro USD right here, and this was the weekly trade. But not only this, look upon a GBP USC and much more. So, these guys are surprising me because most of guys about right now they're performing good women younger less than two months some um, less than even three months but the performance is massively now let's see we have this guy here oh, no, I, don't know, I don't know the name exactly but i see the performance now see the performance see their performance now see this way see their performance you know what it is you know what it is baby see the results is very crazy results very very crazy this is euro usd i'm about to take you out of and this was uh this is our trade i'm about euro usd gbp usd and all that and uh all these are all the members i'm about me email foundation most of them want a less than six months less than two months this was usd card of course most of them bad on a practice that's a thing but it's no it's not bad it's not bad they are still performing most of them they are still performing see this guy here rosa is 0 0.01 see the results right here this is massive this is massive and crazy man very very crazy very very crazy see these are all, all, all my members. Here is members, guys. See, this is the actual performance of them. This guy here, he has with the draws. To the Pongese, you know, actually, uh, the January has been so good at this end of the week. Now, this is the first week of the year. And I myself, I'm active in the markets with them as well. But as well, to transition the free channel. This is a free WhatsApp channel. Link in the description. You can join anytime. We have shared the first trade, which was on Euro USD, USD card, and GBP USD. All these trades, remember, very, very nice. But not only that, the analysis I'm about to share is now to YouTube. So you can join this channel right here. Right now we have 300 plus followers, so make sure you follow this channel and you keep on enjoying, babe. You know what it is. Signing out. Link is in the description for the channel, for our podcast, for the the website. You will learn a lot. Keep following. You know the vibes, man. Let's get it. Now you you will understand why. I was predicting the bell, the bullish market structure. Now we had a strong bullish movement 
as the price was making this swing highs and swing lows, swing highs and swing lows. But inside, we were stuck along this point where we got this rejection. This was the first rejection right here, and you got the other rejection. So what I was considering toward the DXY is the the other push toward the upside as a matter we got a breakout structure right here you can see the candle formation which made the breakout was strong now i consider this as a correction like this one so that we can have the other candle formation like this right here to tap this level here where it's a high the strong high and the final which is this at the monthly level before seeing the other correction like this one now when i switch on four hours this is what i was predicting you can see we are the first attempt of the buyers here from this point here this was the first attempt but as it was the first attempt and we managed to break i remember price was almost almost it had a break of structure along this point here along this high you see we have this area where we got a breaker they later place manage to get his pull back towards inside this zone and this zone it was one of my favorite uh, areas to see more attempts of bias so that we can push price higher now what do i see on the coming week on the coming week i see price may maybe maybe simply call a lay i mean collect itself inside this layer but along the areas that i'll be watching the first area is this area here where we got uh, the strong area where price almost kept on maintaining this area you see we did not break this area we kept on maintaining this low along this level so the key areas now i'll be watching is either to see price breaking this area i have this area and to keep on maintaining this low here once we break this low there's be there, there'll be more chances for price to keep on maintaining this area along this point here now these are my point of reference and this is my zone along my monthly level this is my monthly level now what i'll be waiting to see is to see price surpassing this high and continue toward the upside if not then i'll see price breaking this entire zone and continue toward the downside maybe it can change the direction but the high probability one is the i mean the bullish one because we have this continuation structure this is a continuation structure which means we have the impulse correction and the other impulse so this one the high probability because we only follow what happens in the market you never know because this is the overall analysis you can have your own analysis as well all right now what do we see on the other pairs pair in the usd on the last week that we did we did on euro usd now euro usd we were considering to sell just because price once was breaking entire highs now considering to start with the daily time frame you'll see that euro usd it has a bearish market structure calendry this is a structure that i'm seeing from this higher to this lower here now considering to what we did see on dxy you can see that euro usd is extremely having those highs and lows so we have this our, our high strong high here strong one and we have this lower here this is our low now considering this basically you can see that the price was making these swing guys and the lows and this strong impasse again we have what we call this correction here strong correction then we got a breakout here strong correction then we are extremely considering this as a continuation to tap these points here all right so for us as a uh, at fxb universal i have my members where i we do our analysis we had a discussion towards euro usd last time and we are considering to sell from this point or this point whenever we see any reversal reversal kind of formation which was i think, I think it was on on three hours time frame then where we we got attempts of sellers now currently our tech profits this week was around this level 
but as a swing take profits are almost to these levels so we'll be considering to see a simple push pullback as it has already happened now i can watch it on three hours you'll see you see on three hours we had this strong reversal candle formation you can see this is a quick rejection of sellers of uh, of buyers buyers were rejected towards price price drive and that's the reason why we got this strong push you can see this is a strong push which managed to maintain our actual level here now the thing is my take profit was all set at this next support level just because i knew before closing this week we would have a little bit maybe breaking this level or even rejecting this level as it did and then we got strong price imbalance this one needs a strong correction now what i can see for the coming week on euro usc is either this price here uh to either i mean continue on the downside to break this entire level here i have to see it may i mean breaking this entire level here and respecting this level here but anything can happen as a matter price i mean market is not yet opened we see how price will be reacting inside this level but for this position that i have right here i'm still holding to see price driving all the way toward the downside because it's a strong down push now back to gold this is actual analysis of gold now we show you what i see from the higher time frames now it's that with the uh one sorry from the weekly time frame now let's see on weekly time frames on weekly time frame you will see that we had a strong bullish market structure now from the strong bullish market structure we have what we call this strong new high oh some may call it um, the all-time high where price never even tapped which happened it was around december and then we got this strong low where price once to manage to clear this you can see we had a strong down push which failed to break this hill entire low this is our entire low and this is our entire high where we got a breaker where we got a breaker you see now i can see this high here price drive did not manage to surpass our previously higher so it managed to create this lower here now remember we have this high we, we have this high and we have this low so currently i can see that the price there's a bigger potential for for the market to push all way down inside this level here and continue toward the downside the reason behind just because we kept on maintaining this high by creating this high and then after creating this here you can see price manage to create another low here this is our price low and after that low we created the other you can see the drive of price failed to surpass this and then we created the new law of price bars here along there we failed to surpass this we created a new law at the same time we managed price managed to break that and we created the new low and we failed to surpass that high by creating the other high here now there's a bigger chance for price to keep on praying along this level but the bigger chance of breaking here is quite high just because we have kept on maintaining this entire high here so the drive is either breaking this level here and tapping these up areas here remember this is a weekly market view but once we view it from the from the daily time frame what do we see consider these highs and lows highs and lows because always you you need to understand how to read the price action because price action is what will take you all away from understanding how market moves and then it will be easy for you to know what you should do in the market all right so what do you see on gold right now 
right now you see like uh, price kept on maintaining this high and we managed to break our price here where we created a new row here you get my point eh? and then uh, this is our lower here and this is our high here now from the daily time frame you can see what we are looking for for next coming week <laughs> right now you can see that the price is almost doing uh we're in a bearish market structure to tap this level here and define at this level but for the coming week i'm looking for price to tap these levels or these areas and remember this uh, daily candle which we we crossed with this come uh the rusty week this week unfortunately now what i have to see is the other candle formation to surpass what you call this lower here now for my point of view overall we can see that we be having the selling pressure toward this point now for the coming week i'll be looking for sales on gold now it's up to you to find opportunities along this but i'll be sharing updates on my free your uh, whatsapp channel if you have not joined the link is in the description make sure you join then we'll be seeing little little bit market update towards the gold way and the other trade that i've talked about i hope this video makes sense but make sure or take notes i not give signals in uh, to my youtube channel what i do is just the market overview but take into it make sure you consider criteria which you do consider on your own unless you are my student you know the criteria that i do on performing or on entering trades and managing them we have different criteria that we looked up once we want to take trades i hope this video makes sense to you make sure you give me a like or the follow button if i'm not following this channel next update in the coming week make sure you join the free channel cheers stay safe and trade as concerns you